It's the NFL on EA Sports, and we'll see who rules the skies in today's battle. It's the Cardinals and the Hawks, and it's all up next. With Mary right here in the distance, there are a few cities finer on a clear afternoon than this one, and we have a picture-perfect day for football at Lumen Field in Seattle. Today, we've got a good NFC matchup on tap between the Arizona Cardinals and the Seattle Seahawks. And a welcome in, everybody, with Charles Davis. I'm Brandon Gordon, and Charles, so much gets made about offensive comparisons. Here's a matchup where the defenses may just take center stage. Yeah, we're usually talking about guys scoring touchdowns. How about the guys who prevent them and change the momentum of the game when they take the ball away? I love those ball hawks in the secondary. People after my own heart. the gun. Murray flush to his right. And he can't find anywhere to go with it. And he goes down. Daryl Taylor got in there to drop him. Now that was a passer's nightmare. The front door totally shut down by the defense. So he kept going backwards hoping to find another avenue of escape. It didn't exist. loss on the sack makes this job much more difficult. It's now second down and 22 yards to go. Murray to run again. And nothing doing here as this time the run maybe gets him back to the line of scrimmage, but that's it. Call it no gain on the keeper and it's going to bring up the third down. Shotgun now for Murray. Seahawk defense gets to him and they bring him down. The pressure from multiple guys there as they bury him for a good nine-yard loss. But you know it's never easy to get Kyler Murray down to the ground and to do it with a sack on their first drive. What a great tone setter defensively. Oh, and no one's celebrating more than the defensive coordinator because that's all he's preached all week. And take it right on the 30. Well, that looked for a second like he might take it all the way, but as it stands, it's still a massive return. And this offense, they've got it set up on the silver platter. First and goal inside the 10. Kenneth Walker headed back out there. And Charles, he's a rookie. He's put it on the ground once, maybe defensively. Now they're saying, okay, we can get this young buck to cough it up two, three times. They'll look to run with Dallas. And he's across the chalk, into the end zone. Touchdown, Seahawks. DJ Dallas. A three-yard touchdown run. And the Seahawks post the first points of the ball game as they take the lead here in this second quarter. So a good job there, Charles, taking advantage of the short field, and they score first, punching it in on the short touchdown run. I love the theme there, right? They didn't have to do anything big on that drive. And now Metcalf going to get a chance to run. Extra tight ends in the formation here as they line up third and two. On third down, here's Walker. And he's across for the touchdown. And in the final minute, that should just about seal it. On third down and short, and everything well executed. He not only gets the first down, Charles, he gets the touchdown as well. And you see the defense commit to the run so often in these situations. There's always that little bit of hesitancy, isn't there, partner? Thinking that they may play action yet. They took advantage of that hesitancy and found their way into the end zone with a running play. And after the touchdown, here's Myers to boot it away. Taking it about the one. Greg Dortch returning. 
And no alley to be found. The coverage was solid, and he's dropped at the 18. On first and 10, here's Murray. Now a desperation throw deep downfield. And in. Back to the air on second down, it's Murray. Now Murray. And this will be incomplete. One second left to go. It's going to be easier now. You know they're going to be sitting back and waiting on everything, and they force an incompletion there. And that will be incomplete as time has run out on this football game. So the victory here for Seattle, and it was their defense that led the way, allowing just three points that lone field goal in the entire second half. And remember the old adage, offense sells tickets, defense does what? Wins championships. And in this game, maybe a championship wasn't won, but a game was by the defense, right? Held them to just a field goal? That's a heck of a job. I mean, when they went out there with that determination and a pretty good game plan, pretty good idea of what they wanted to accomplish, just love the execution, love the tenacity, love the way they finished.